The shells that Russians bought from North Korea are exploding in gun barrels. The Russians are experiencing a shortage of ammunition of their own production, so they use artillery and mortar charges from the North Korea which are of low quality. This is stated in the morning summary of the general staff of the armed forces of Ukraine. Due to the lack of ammunition of their own production, the occupiers were forced to use shells and mines from North Korea. Due to the unsatisfactory condition of such ammunition, rare cases of their bursting right in the barrels of guns and mortars of the occupiers are recorded, which leads to the loss of weapons and personnel of the invaders. In particular, such cases were recorded in the Dnipro troop grouping, where General Teplinsky is the commander. Russian President Vladimir Putin has been accelerating Moscow's rapprochement with Pyongyang. In one outcome, Russia supplied North Korea with flour in exchange for artillery shells needed for its invasion of Ukraine. On December the 15th, however, photographic evidence surfaced that the flour Russia sent was past its expiration date. It shows a close-up of two bags of Russian flour weighing two kilograms each. They were from a shipment of 100,000 tons of flour unloaded at the port of Chongjin in northeastern North Korea. Although the expiration date was May the 5th, 2022, markets throughout North Korea still sold the rotten flour. It is likely that the flour was Russian leftovers, according to reports Kim received.